Hi everyone, and here's a devotional for Monday, August 9th, 2021, entitled, No Such Thing as a Little Sin. Whoever has been born of God does not sin, for his seed remains in him, and he cannot sin because he has been born of God. 1 John 3, 9. Two teenage siblings asked their father for money to go see a movie with their friends. Knowing the content of the movie was inappropriate, the father told them they couldn't go. The teens debated their position. There was only a few curse words and one minor immoral scene, but the rest of the movie was wonderful. The father still refused. Sulking, they retreated to their rooms until they were called for supper. When it came time for dessert, the mother set a pan of freshly baked brownies on the table. The father cut large squares for his children and said, Your mother has made your favorite dessert, but there is one thing you should know before you eat it. I had her mix in some manure. How could you? they moaned. Oh, it's just a little bit, the father answered. Enjoy! Needless to say, the entire pan of brownies was thrown out. Even a little sin is enough to corrupt, so don't mix it in. How can you have the strength to choose holiness over sin? And what it has here is your response, so you can think about your response. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to repeat the, the question. How can you have the strength to choose holiness over sin? Um, it's hard. It's Like I said yesterday, it's not easy. But I ask God to help me. Um, one thing I've learned to do is to talk to Jesus. I know that I've told you guys this, but um, I've learned to, to be able to talk to Jesus about everything. Every single thing that I go through, I've learned to talk to him about. You know, every temptation that I have, and I ask him to help me, and he does. And it's, you know, it, to try... To do that on our own is not easy, but um, to do it in his strength, he, he helps us. and He gives us the ability to, to overcome temptation, and I'm so thankful for that. And so, may the Lord bless you all and be with you till tomorrow.